the revolt of the head. I could swear I heard something in the bushes. It could be my nerves. The jungle is full of strange towns. Why in heaven's name did I ever wander away from my party? The lure of the primitive had sent Brian Lasker to the trackless jungles of North Bionio. As a famous anthropologist, he knew there was a world beyond the real and a tangible, filled with mystery of terrifying visions and strange savage powers. It was a world he wished to discover and study. As a po- as his party left Cumberland, the hand of fate intervenes, and Brian suddenly finds himself separated from lost in a wild, dangerous jungle filled of hostile tribes. Suddenly, a savage scream sent rent the air. Cobolo sees him. Tie him up, do not kill. Let me go, let go of me, Razara. Let me speak, wait. Hell, he speaks our language. We will make a good sacrifice. I will show the tribe that Ulu is a great witch doctor. Just the primitive I wanted to meet, and now it's too late. Now or later in the tribal village, look, I've captured a white man. It will make a great magic. No one will. No one will the Samara League fear the, uh, their enemies. Alu had spoken. If they take my head, your your powers lose all your. You will lose all your powers. The witch doctor will warn you. You will. You will speak or tongue. Listen, I'm so really, are not headhunters. We are the enemies of the hunters. We are fire worshippers. I come as a friend to learn your powers. I am always an, almost also an enemy of the headhunters. I do not trust you. The headhunters have taken many captives. The, the tribe blames my weak magic, but I show them that you, when you are sacrificed, Ulu is mighty beyond. Mighty flame god Ulu calls. Incredible, primal hypnotism is a primitive tribe. He does not feel the flame or its illusion. Your magic is strong, Lulu. Now I must see what our enemy is doing for those ornaments of one of our captured tribesmen. I'll call upon his spirits, which is imprisoned in his shrunken head. Great flame god, I will call upon the spirit of our captured brother. Nizam, Shah, Nama, Huma, Barara, come. Can this mumbo jumbo really produce anything? You called me, Ololo, from the village of the headhunters. My spirit wonders, what is your wish? Great heavens, an no apparition. Oh, tell me, Hassan, my brother. Our tribe is in danger, great danger, Ololo. Even now the headhunters approach our village to attack. They're mad for our heads. Now I must go. I warned you, our warriors, what to do. What do you want? Free me and I have powerful magic. will help your tribe. I'll fight on your side. A few minutes later, I may come as a fire guard. will strengthen our arms. Close your ears to the magic. Ready with your spears, Sir Oli. Kill, kill, let no one escape. They're falling back after them. No, no, but my son, do not answer their cursed call. Stay here. He's in a trance. His mind seems paralyzed. I must break this spell. We'll wind up a head, a head pole. Ah, I'm released. Help me. Go, look, I am weak. You are indeed a great friend. You have saved my son's life, but... By destroying their magic, ask oh, as you think, you shall have it. 
There are the two things, I Lord, I must, I would like to learn your magic, and then I wish my freedom. A few days later, you have already mastered much, my friend, but this is a supreme test. What if you, what you see you will terrify and hurt you, perhaps kill you? Will you take the chance? I will have gone this far already. And not stop now. I'll go ahead, O Lulu. No, take away the, these horrible visions. Oh, I can't stand it. Ah, enough to part you, spirits of evil. Where are they? I thought they were going mad. I thought I was going mad, but but not now. But now it's it's all gone. You come through the test, my friend. Your powers are even greater than Lulu. Go test yourself there in the fire. Why well, doesn't hurt at all? In fact, my body's cold. You know this power. I don't understand. It's granted a few, to a few, and um, you're one of those. Now you must leave this so violently. A few days later. Brian staggered into the Kalulu, the British helper, very Mister. Can't believe you're alive. What happened to you? But living with a so ugly witch doctor, what I saw would amaze the world. With that evening, his power beyond belief, he complete master of the world of spiritual rot. You think I believe that? Those natives of ignorant beggars. You have been unconscious or drunk, Rustica. If you lecture about this in London, you'll they laugh you off the stage. Back in London, at the first museum took lecture, you may laugh, but I tell you, these primitive powers possess explicable powers. Aha, uh -huh. jungle must have driven you blarmy, blarmy. Then he to alone with his brother Gerald. I wish you'd stop making a fool of yourself, Brian. I really don't believe this stuff. I do, Gerald. I advise you to learn something about these primitive tribes. We go to, to Boyon. It's your first overseas consignment. I don't swallow this voodoo. I say all they need is a big stick and keep these natives in line. They're just one step above animals. Really? And how do you explain this? I learned the secret from one of these natives. Now you look ignorant. Look. Shaman and to listen, your prison spirits, why blast it? With their eyes open, they were smiling, some trick. The hallucination of seeing Gerald kept left unconvinced. A few weeks later, in Cumberland. I hope you're not like that underfresh brother of yours. He told a world story story when he got back from the jungle. Think he's mad. Now let's take me to the chief of the tribe, General Cameron. I want to press him with my new administration. Bago, I warn you, if it, if this headhunting and currying doesn't stop, I'll send you to jail. I expect you to carry out the orders. You cannot tell me to change, change customs hundreds of years. This is our religion, our magic. You insolent beggar. Time for... T take that for talking back to me. Ah, uh, beware, but I'll meet strange magic tonight. You'll pay for that. That night, Gerald was drawn from his bed for a miserable fault. I must get out of my way. Something out there is calling me. Wait, where do you think you're going? Someone leaves his post at this town. I must get out of my way. Something out there is calling me. Nothing can stop me. I answer a call from the jungle. It's in my blood, drawing me from the ways of false. Let me go, go with me, you fool. Oh, a frantic shirt was made for Gerald, current general. We've beaten up and down the jungle for five miles now. There's no sign of Lester, sir. I told you not to meddle with Agora. When Byron received the word from the boy on, General Gerald's departure disappeared in the jungle. I must leave at once, but you know, I hope I shall not be too late. Days later, Byron arrives in Coverland. Look here, but Lester. We need Sprashka to keep the natives in line. Don't they tell us like them? I can't promise anything. He's responsible for Joe's death. I must justice when justice done. 
What do you want here, Colonel? Your men have searched you already. Good Lord, it's too late. There is still something I can do. Don't do this, Lester, you fool. Those men, you'll fall for meddling <coughs> with these natives. <coughs> I said, get out. I want to be alone here for a few minutes. When Baron was alone, Sakodara's spirits had departed. I command you not to listen to my bidding. Listen. A few months later, dog, beware. Before morning, you shall be. Your bones shall not be found where Akko has spoken. Let's get away from here. You stirred up the devil, but Asgara. There's no telling what he'll do now. Do me one last favour, Colonel. I want to be tied firmly to the bed tonight. And I have a guard posted outside my bed door. The mad Lester. But I do as you say, I'm beginning to believe. There's more to this voodoo witchcraft than I thought. That night, unseen power trudged up down his body. Ah, I must be free. Let me out. A call. I must answer the call. It embarrasses hunt. An unbelievable savage battle that raged. Help, help. These heads are beating me to the death. I have no ma power against this magic. Ah. The morning came, Lester. Do you hear what they say? Some strange power beat Baraska to death. They're terrified. They promised to give up hunt hunting. Tell me, what did you do to in Chaka's hunt today? I spoke to the heads. One of them was Gerald's. He led them against Baraska last night. Yes, you were tied down last night. The guard was stationed. You could not get away. There must be something terribly real about this magic. But how did it happen? Believe me, Colonel, I don't know. I possess a strange, savage power, but I'll never understand it. I only used it to avenge my jails, to avenge jails' death for the end.